but this is cannot be at any way no um, journalist no citizen of india no thinking man can defend this a crime has been committed case must be lodged prosecution begin and whatever punishment the court decides must be meted out there well, is no escape from that no Ch vinod mehta wanted to respond to your description to his attempt to read out the not SMS defending it please again i must say i mean the last thing i would want to do is defend i am not defending it i i am saying that tarun then must how face are you getting whatever how are you reading the, the law says a rape accused person statement how are you reading on the channel how are you reading and rape accused person uh, sms on the channel because this you is the to defend him i am saying no, that this is the, the i am saying why has he not gone to delhi police or goa police why is he hiding behind he is an accused please he don't shout please don't shout please don't please have some manners no, don't shout don't shout at me your stature is trying no it is shocking that a person of your stature is getting out a person who is accused of rape and you are trying to uh, uh, give his uh, uh, statement is sms to the public what message is it going that the media is trying to support and why has this sprung up now my question is saying, no why has this other version sprung up now and all people sitting on high moral ground all these years and preaching to the whole world may i just say and they are now trying to say no no this was consensual may i just there is they know the girl was as guilty what is this really i i am no, just swap a, a, a member of our community swapan das gupta just, accused of this swapan das gupta yes yeah or no i just want to know which tarun tejpal are we to believe the one who says this was a drunken uh, banter this was a horrible misjudgment or that this was a consensual act for which he took the burden of blame very much like jesus christ took took the burden of blame for others i mean which one are we to believe i mean if a per person shifts his position three times in a very short time period what are we to make of it that there are ad hoc damage limitation exercises being mounted at every point and the message a very sinister message going out to the victim that either you play ball with us otherwise boy just watch how we take it to the courts yeah you are exactly you either you, either you play either you sanjay roy will respond to that sanjay roy to swapan das either you play ball with us and we express sympathy swapan. for you and we do some and symbolic act of moving away on a sabbatical for six swapan months but if you take us I on just, just, if just you take us on up, we will sentence. we will bring out the other version and put you into disrepute i just want to hear sanjay's defense of what swapan das uh, uh, gupta one, said one if he has any one, one second let's hear sanjay's you defense they come back to chalo Okay, okay. Swapan, that's not that's not quite fair. You know, at the end of the day, I think all of us forget that there are people okay. involved at the end of this. There's a person who something has happened with. There are two incidents. There are people involved. You know, different perceptions are always uh, presented differently. Whether Tarun and, and again, I want to say that at no point of time, according to me, did Tarun try to cover up this entire situation. He accepted Shoma's request that he should resign Shonjo, and remove himself from the situation. When you say so that, hear me out. Hear me out. So that, so me, that they could continue the with. inquiry. <laughs> Whether it was right or wrong to do, let the law law decide. But the But law has been avoided. You know, cover up. Sanjay Roy. Sanjay Roy. Message Ul, Sanjay Roy. What you forget there? There's somebody there. who's saying Mr. that Roy. this is what the situation no, no, is. Mr. Mr. Roy, a simple thing which 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 I would like to bring to your attention is that. Shoma Chaudhary and Tarun Tejpal and the Tehelka uh, management are guilty of not bringing this to the attention of the law. You are today saying Absolutely. let the law Absolutely. take its course. So If throw the go... book at them. So throw the book at them, Arna. But let the law Precisely. take its course. No, no. One second. On this panel you, already deciding. You, you think? Deciding. Oh, you, you think? Members of your panel you, have already, already said no, no, that already. he's not only accused, Shoma but Chaudhary he's already been convicted, law. and the law, and he should go. Absolutely I mean, so not. I think you're. We are not. I think we are not I think the jury. Are, I think we are not the judges. I think you're. There's a process of I law. Think, let the process I of think law take its course. You know, please. There was complete disregard for the process of the law because the Vishaka guidelines make it clear that harassment. That if the harassment falls within the purview of a certain section of the indian penal code then the onus is on the employer to initiate action and lodge the complaint they did not go to the police so they were they trying to settle it internally they were violating the law 
by doing so. Oh, uh, Arnab, if there were omissions, as you have pointed out, let that take its own you, you, No, not omissions. You said that no you, omissions. What, do you think that if this matter had not come into the public domain, if this matter had not come to the public domain, would there have been any action even in the formation of a committee? Show me one bit of action that they took in the formation yes. of a committee before it came out in the media. 150% yes. The what? day that this, this letter came to the knowledge of Shoma, I know because I was traveling out. It was Tuesday morning. I was told that Tarun has sent a letter out resigning from the post. Why would anybody want to resign from a post and issue a letter to all be his editors taking well, absolute be because you don't want what the happened if there was going to be a cover-up? Because up. you think you'll so settle the matter there. Be I think it's because absolutely because you think you'll settle the matter there. Bachi is responding because, to you, Bachi. Because, Bachi. Uh, because Arna, come yeah. on, we can, One Arna, we can sit here at the studio no, it is not. and it, talk till the Mr. Sanjay Roy and say this and that. Mr. Sanjay Roy, Mr. Roy, Mr. Roy, you think you want to you want to tell people you want to tell people that the managing editor and the editor in chief of the Helka don't know the law. You want I us to believe? It. I mean, frankly, I suspect so. You I suspect mean, they don't you know, know the correct law. Correct me if I'm wrong. Okay, fine. I don't think half Chandan the Mitra, in this country Chandan Mitra, know Sanjoy the law. Roy says they don't know the law. If they've no, made a mistake, it's because I they don't know the law. I said perhaps. No, no, perhaps what? they don't know Please. the law. Chandan, Roy, Chandan Mitra. Your... Chandan Mitra. No, watch it. Watch it. I'll come back. It's Chandan Mitra. Sanjoy Roy. Mr. Sanjay Roy may not be aware of the uh, se se several judgments of the Supreme Court in which has been made clear that ignorance of the law is no ground for defense. That you are not Absolutely. supposed not to know the law and people in such high pr prominent positions who are constantly you know, carrying out uh, uh, this thing, uh, things, alluring people into doing things that they would not normally do and uh, sort of um, getting them on camera uh, and totally bloated up that you know we have embarrassed governments, we have embarrassed people. They don't know the law. Are you, are you, I mean, we are a bunch of fools, bunch of idiots sitting here, and they don't know the law. They have been under so many litigations. They haven't heard of the Bisaka guidelines. They have They second. don't know the law. What are you? And, and avoid the law. But basically, and, avo and one sec, I want to also add. I what want to also add, add avoid one, one avoid the law. Just avoid the law. They do not. They do not yeah, even. I, I, I they, therefore. Therefore, the, what it was suggested that Shoma Chaudhuri is complicit in this entire um, cover-up conspiracy and, is entirely correct. And then the, and and then the argument that you know that that you see basically there is a threatening undertone. And today, what has happened is that an attempt is being made to uh, array, array a certain number of people, the bigwigs uh, like Mr. Vinod Mehta to come into Tarun's defense and then basically t tell uh, and the victim yeah, I mean, and her I mean, friends I think that look, like we are powerful people. We have, we have high uh, people, very high unfair. Positions. So you better. <coughs> no, sorry, you know, you, know you, have, you have fallen in my esteem very badly today. I must tell you in public. I've always regarded I, 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 you. I think you have misunderstood me completely. It's simply unacceptable. I, I, <coughs> I, I am simply... Yes, Mr. Mehta. What can I say, Tarun? I, I mean, what can I say, Arnab? I mean, I'm, I'm being attacked left, right and center. I am agreeing with you that he you should face it. the full force of the law. I am asking, I am saying that he, he, whatever he if has done, guilty. the law if should take guilty, its own prove course. The prove the guilt, but he will have his say. Of course. This is uh, the, the television yes, debates. Yes, thank yes, God, are not juries and judges. Mr. Yes, let him go. Yes, let the law take its course. Uh, yeah, but Sanjay Roy, one second, one second. Tehelka did not go to the law. <coughs> Tehelka did not follow yes. the law. Tehelka avoided the law. And today you take that fig leaf of an argument that you go behind the law, Mr. Sanjay Roy. You're in Singapore. Are you aware that Tehelka has not yet responded to the Goa police's request to send them the victim statement? The Goa Director General of Police said the Goa Police requested Shoma Chaudhary yesterday to share the information we had, she had received regarding this girl's complaint. I think you have to be thoroughly uh, you know, arrogant. You have to be thoroughly arrogant to say that we will not cooperate unless the girl files a complaint. We won't even uh, cooperate if there is an appropriate FIR filed in this case. So, you know, 
And by the way, Sanjay Roy, do you, you think anyone... I, I, I you, think you're misrepresenting the statement. Well, Arnab, the, you're misrepresenting well the you know... Me, the, you, Again, I don't know everything. I'm sitting yeah, You away. should know. I you, think you're you, you should speak to the, the Goa Director General of Police and you should ask him when they wrote to the Tehelka management and what they respond. My question is this, that today, one charge is made, there is an attempt, Bachi, to sow the seeds of doubt about what exactly happened. Now, yes, is that... that's you know, right. To sow that's the right. seeds of doubt and indicate that it may have been consensual. This, Bachi, after taking a high moral ground and saying, we are so upset at the Helka, we'll not allow something like this to happen, that he's recused himself. Remember, not resign. Do you think that attempt to sow the seeds of doubt will backfire? You know, it, it's actually absolutely clear. The first mistake that Tarun made was to write that lacrimonious letter and talk about penance and lacerate and, and, and stuff like that. And rather than coming straight up front and said, yes, I've committed what is an offence. This is, this is what it is. Here's my apology. And yes, uh, Shoma had to take the case to the police as she was bound to do under yeah. the Vishaka guidelines. Now, having made that first mistake, now it's actually compounding the whole issue. And uh, by saying that, no, now there is another version. If there was another version, tell me, Arnab, why, did why would an intelligent man like Tarun Tejpal open all his flanks to attack by first of all virtually admitting that yes a terrible terrible crime though he would rather call it an indiscretion has been committed untoward incident what is what is ridiculous I think, words. you know both chandan and you have gone after vinod quite unfairly because and i really want to i have not gone after vinod that. mehta i have and, merely uh, i want i have merely stopped uh, uh, Mr. Vinod Mehta, who I have repeated, I have the utmost regard from, from reading an SMS because I believe that I have a disagreement over the reading of the SMS. I have not been unfair to All Mr. Right. Mehta. And yes. secondly, Thank I you. think Mr. Sanjay Roy should not yeah. defend uh, should not defend uh, Shoma and, and Tarun because I think he's making a terrible defense lawyer. He is putting words, he is into really into their mouth which are going to be criminally uh, damaging he's trying to say that they did not know the law how can an editor of a of any newspaper let alone such a hard hitting newspaper ever feign ignorance of the law in this case well, you know the simple i mean and here the whole qu question, question really no no arnab i think here the whole problem is not only in the case of tarun but in the case of a lot of powerful people who have this sense of entitlement you know whether they are chief ministers or whether they are politicians of another stripe or whether they are editors or whether they are people as an in emphasis because they are in a position of power, they think that they can get away with no, why rape, did, which I think is no, as no, why, why did Why did Tarun, two questions really need to be answered and Sanjay, I will answer it after I come out of the break. I have one may I just to, add one more yes, point to what okay, Bachi has said? Gupta, yeah. or, or no, may I just add a yeah, point? Please. I have one point that to make. I do not believe, I do not believe that the, the ignorance of the law was the case. I'm almost virtually convinced. Arnab, can I just make a point? After a complaint like that, a lawyer was consulted. Arnab, can I make a point? It was an attempt deliberately to skirt the skirt the law by having an out of court private ne privately negotiated. Arnab, can I make a point? And it was only the publicity. The, it was Arnab, the public can I just make a point? The emails which gave, which they destroyed that. No, no. Clause. Why did why did Tarun Tejpal resign Arnab, if it was consensual? And no, one second. If, if it was consensual, Arnab, why did why did Tarun point? why did Tarun Tejpal resign? And why did Shoma Arnab, Chaudhary overrule an innocent point? man? Yes, Vinod Mehta. Arnab, can I make a point? Yes, Mr. Mehta. Arnab, can I make a point? I am saying you hang Tarun Tejpal. I am not saying. But in the media, we must also be honest that for years it's been going on that editors, I mean, they are still flourishing in the business today who hit upon junior interns, who hit upon uh, trainees. I mean, the worst kept secret in our profession is the kind of immoral things that senior journalists do. And it's, I'm, I'm, I hope that the Tarun Tejpal affair will bring out the state of rot in our profession in terms of morality. Right. But now our let us now let us return now let us return let us return to the very specifics of this case. Now we are talking about several flip flops over the last few days and the different loopholes in their arguments. 